Here I am at Bears Paw Golf Club. Right here behind me, I can't wait to show you what we're up to. Can you see that halo? That's unbelievable. Here I am inside Bears Paw Golf Course Clubhouse. As you can see, the clubhouse is not finished and I'm gonna share a little bit of information on why. So a few years ago, this was a course that was owned by about 500 members. They started building this clubhouse. You know, costs got a little bit out of control and unfortunately went into receivership. Sitting here this morning with our architect, designers, my partners on this golf course, looking at some of the design details for the clubhouse behind me. We're geared up, we wanna get moving on this building. Our members are excited to see it. Just looking at all the fine details are required to actually get this process going again. So I'm gonna take you around and show you a little bit about this Clubhouse, ooh, take a look at that. That is gonna be a new fireplace. This is our banquet, wedding, member event center. Literally, it is absolutely incredible. Uh, maybe you can actually hear the work going on outside too. Um, you can definitely hear it, so that's a good sign because yeah, we're moving ahead. This is fantastic. And then look at this view. I mean, look at that view. You can see the Rocky Mountains, it's incredible. So we're actually opening up these walls a little bit as well, and we'll have open dining in this space. And then what we're thinking is just down this hallway here beside me, we would open this area up. We're talking about a couple of golf simulators. And then here, just as I'm coming up to you right now, we would have the new pro shop. And then over here, it opens up to a bar up here on the right. There's a fireplace on this side, which might be my favorite part of this clubhouse. Uh, uh, I don't know. I mean, so many different things I love about this clubhouse, but out here, there is a courtyard, an open air courtyard that I think is just super dynamic. Let me know in the comments below if you like what we're doing on the exterior of the clubhouse. Do you have other thoughts, ideas, suggestions? Let me know. I'm thrilled with the progress. There's lots more work to get done. I'll be back during the summer to share more about what's happening at the clubhouse and more about the golf course in general. We'll see you next time.